It was a time of darkness. It was a world of fear. It was the age of gargoyles. Welcome back, everyone. Toysh is here, and I am back yet again to give you guys another news update out of nowhere. Last evening, NECA Toys was like, hey, everybody awake? Boom. We got ourselves a new toy line coming. Disney afternoons are back. NECA Toys is officially making Gargoyles action figures. They released this photo of Goliath. Yeah, it's just amazing. And the interwebs and everybody just went off on this. This is very exciting. I loved the cartoon show. First two seasons. Goliath Chronicles, we'll talk about that later. <laughs> Oddly enough, as much as I like the show, I never got into the Kenner stuff. I think I have one or two, something here or there that I got maybe from buying like a grab bag collection, something like that. It just never really hit me. You know, it, they were cool, but they, I didn't, that's when like Batman, the animated series out. There's a lot of different toy lines that I was collecting at that time as a kid, you know, you gotta be selective. So yeah, Gargoyles was never one that I really went for, but the show was killer that five episode opening like the first season it caught my attention and i was like wow and then xanatos said you know he said the swear everyone i remember that at lunchtime everyone's like oh my god did you hear xanatos said the swear word he said it well he, he, he was in context you know what i mean so that's why they left it in but that was always the show growing up where they're like xanatos said the word hell Ooh, edgy batman the animated series didn't do that until later with the you know Justice League versus the Fatal Five. It's out of place. Anyways, so you're probably wondering, okay, tell us about the Gargoyles action figure line coming from NECA Toys this summer, which is very cool to hear. Now, will there be more Gargoyles in this Gargoyles line? Most likely. To talk about Goliath specifically, he will be available for pre-order later today. So when you see this video, depending on when I will have the link in the description below so you can get them. These will be available everywhere. They're not going to be exclusive. They will be at retailers, online, things of that nature. So everyone that really wants one should be able to get one. I'm just stoked that they're doing that. I want to see more Gargoyle stuff. I want them to bring the show back. Maybe do like a, not a reboot, but you know, I'm kind of, I would like to see a movie actually, like a movie series in the vein of like Pirates of the Caribbean or something like that. That would be really ideal to be quite honest with you. That show was killer. And Keith David, the voice of Spawn, amongst other things, was Goliath. It was absolutely killer. To talk about the figure, he will be in the ultimate sort of articulation style. He will be eight inches tall with a wingspan of 16 inches. That is a giant action figure. That is going to be great. He will come with interchangeable hands, as you can see throughout these photos, and interswappable heads, where he kind of, you know, he's the more solemn, Shakespearean type Goliath. And then when he goes like all aggro crag and like white eyes and, you know, tries to kill Xanatos or whoever else, <laughs> the pack. You know what I mean? Which now thinking about it, oh my God, can you think about all the character selection that NECA could do? Because you know they're going to do that. I mean, look what they do in the Ninja Turtle line. They could just have at it. God, all the gargoyles, Elisa Maza. This is going to make for one heck of a cool line. The accessories, to me, is the best part. He comes with the book. I think it's like the book of spells or something like that. It's probably the book, you know, from the very first season. There's a lot of books in this show. But you know what I mean? Like the ones that they, they curse them and then they end up going to stone for a thousand years until you raise them above the clouds and Xanatos does all that. Go and watch the show. It's on Disney+. Plus. And then he also comes with a pepper because in case you didn't know this, Goliath is a big fan of spicy foods. Huh? Jalapeno. Jalapeno. Which is a nice little character trait. So NECA threw that in. They always do their research. They are fantastic when it comes to putting in these little show specific little nuances. So very cool to see. He will ship in a big you know box with the flapper window and everything else. This is exciting. So think of it, you know, summertime is the release in and around, let's say July, 2021. Pre-orders go up again today. Very excited. This is going to be killer. I think this is going to be an amazing figure line. So looking forward to it, but I'm curious to know what you guys think. Were you into Gargoyles? Did you watch the cartoon show? How about the toy line by Kenner? And what do you think about new NECA toys? Gargoyles figures. Comment below, let me know. Let's talk everything Gargoyles. And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, when Gargoyles come alive, evil can't survive. We are 
gargoyles. And when we do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.